Well, we all know firefighters face dangerous and very intense moments every single day. Today, Dearborn Heights Fire Department firefighters let their local leaders not just see but also experience what it is that they actually do. It's called Fire Ops 101. It's put on by the city's firefighter union. Megan Woods was there at Wayne County Community College's training facility in Taylor to give us an inside look at exactly how the program works. The morning starts in the classroom with instruction, but in just minutes, elected officials are thrown into real life scenarios with hands on experience. She's, she's on me. Let's go nice and slow, slow. OK, just walking down yep. from city council members to members of US Congress. Today is not an average day at the office. All right, go ahead. Kick your other leg out. Dearborn Heights Fire Marshal Max Mitz say the firefighters union planned an action packed day for these leaders. Search and rescue. So you want to maintain three points of contact if you can. Ladder in a building. Vehicle extrication. Advance in a hose line. A lot more gallons per minute we're flowing here. Just a, a day in life of a fireman. Up on me, I'm good. Dearborn Heights Councilman Mo Bedoun is in his third term, but this is his very first time doing this program. It, it was difficult, it was hard, and again, it was extremely surreal. Especially going into a smoky home simulation to save a life. Uh, they were telling us that they had a situation like this recently in the south end of Dearborn Heights, and it was real. At times, it can be a little entertaining. It's good to see them outside of their comfort comfort zone. But the true purpose is education and a little more understanding. Oh, the uh, president actually first reached out to me and said, hey, you know, we're going to do this right around an election year. Uh, so that they understand when negotiations comes around, this is what we put our lives on day in and day out. And also for us to actually meet the people that kind of sign our checks and uh, are the people that get us a new fire truck or a new fire station or just hose or extrication equipment. Most importantly, these leaders will never look at a fire truck the same. All right. Thank you. Now you understand when, when a fire truck is coming through and they got their lights on, why it's important to move out of the way. In Taylor, Megan Woods, Local 4.